how do marine creatures deal with buoyancy? Most of bony fish have a swim bladder that helps them achieve perfect neutral buoyancy at any depth. This allows them to save energy while swimming. Other fish don't have a swim bladder, and their lifestyle is different because of that. Most of them spend a great amount of time on the seafloor, and their eyes are often on the top of their head to improve their field of view. In the absence of a swim bladder, some sharks and waves need to swim all the time to avoid sinking to the bottom. Others can stop and rest because they can pump water through their gills while being motionless. The turtle doesn't have a swim bladder, but she has lungs and dives on one breath of air. She controls her buoyancy with her lung volume and she is very good at it. She takes just the right amount of air in her lungs to establish the right buoyancy at target depth. She chooses either to be slightly negatively buoyant to forage comfortably on the seafloor, neutrally buoyant so she can swim over the reef easily, either to travel somewhere or to make a survey of her feeding grounds, looking for the best sponges to eat, or she can take enough air in her lungs to be positively buoyant so she can forage comfortably under an overhang without spending energy to stay there. Since the day she pulled herself out of a sand pit to run toward her destiny, the turtle has learned all this dive skill on her own. Not too bad for an air-breathing animal born on dry land. <laughs>